I get up excited every morning to come to work. I just had another situation where I've been dealing with some clients for eight years. The pre-retirement, we did the plans. We talked about all their dreams and where they wanted to go. They had two major trips on their list. One was to go to the East Coast and one was to go to Alaska. They were in my office this week and they said to me, Tanya, we just came back from Alaska. And I get goosebumps because I've known for years, eight years, that this was their goal, this was their dream in retirement, and they just got back. And one of the people that they wanted to share that with was me, their financial advisor. Um, I'm a retirement specialist and I work predominantly with clients that are within three years of retirement or fully retired. And the reason I do that is because I love it. It is absolutely joyful to have a client come in and say to me, I'm giving my notice in six weeks or six months or two years and to have me help them plan for all those things that they've waited for, for all those crappy days that they've had at work that they've said, I can't wait until I become retired and now that day is coming. And so I get to help them start planning that glorious stage of their lives and help them spend their money in the most productive and tax efficient way. There's a difference in retirement versus accumulation. It's a totally different stage of life and it's a, it's a great time. It's a time when they should have minimal worries and have the maximum amount of fun while still keeping in mind all the great things like tax efficiency and, and making sure that if they want to leave an inheritance or whatever they want to do. But that's the point. It's their money and they get to make those choices. The difference between someone who deals with a retired person versus someone who's gathering their money for retirement is your goals and your directions change. When you're getting ready for retirement, most people start talking about they want growth and they're willing to take some risk and they're willing to do things differently because they have time. When you're retired, the time changes. The difference is, is that now we're, we're not looking at growth as always being our number one priority. We're looking at preservation of capital. We're looking at security and we're looking at simplicity. Most retired people, they want to go travel. They don't want to have to worry about the 50 statements that are coming in the mail. They want someone that will take care of them, not just send them a statement once a year. Um, my name is Tanya Herman Van Thine, and I'm from Sunstone Retirement Specialists and Peak Investments. You know what? It's going to sound corny, but I love what I'm doing every day.